Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So after posting earlier today about the desktop browser market share for July by StatCounter, time to have a look at the Windows version market share for a comparison between June and July of this year. Now, out of the six versions, three have decreased in market share and three have increased, so it's a 50-50 split. Now, first of all, Windows 8.1 is one of those to have decreased from 0.28 to 0.23%. Windows XP has increased in its market share very slightly. And that's moved from 0.43 to 0.44%. Windows 8 has increased from 0.31% from June to 0.88% in July. Windows 7 has decreased from 2.19% to 2.04%. Now that's all the unsupported versions. And then yeah, I think the big one here is that Windows 10 is starting to decrease quite fast. And that's moved from 47.83% to 42.99%. And when I posted for June last month for the StatCounter server results for June, Windows 11 and Windows 10 were neck on neck. And we can see now that Windows 11 has moved into first spot and that has increased from 48.89% to 53.39%. So that's quite an increase over the course of one month. Now, a big reason why I feel Windows 11's market share is increasing quite steadily now and overtaken Windows 10 is because, first of all, all of your new devices that are sold now when it comes to laptops and so on have got Windows 11 pre-installed. And secondly, another reason is, is because a lot of your so-called average home users are not going to jump to another operating system. They're just going to carry on using Windows. So they would just automatically upgrade to Windows 11 if their systems are supported, as an example. So those are just two reasons. But nonetheless, 53.39%. And if we head to the chart, yeah, we can see when I posted last month, Windows 11 was just behind, very close to Windows 10. And now we can see Windows 11 has moved past Windows 10 and Windows 10 now is what I would say starting to nosedive and the rest here at the bottom the unsupported when it comes to the bigger scheme of things not too much movement year on year so what do you guys think about this market share movement let me know your thoughts down below I'd be interested to hear so thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one